Hey guys, I got a 1984 Suzuki wet bike. Well, Suzuki powered wet bike. It is the 50 horse model. It is for sale. I bought this about, I bought this back in the spring of this year, 17. Um, it was in pretty good shape. Uh, the seat needed to be recovered. As you can see, I recovered the seat. Um, I put in, I got new grips on it. I got a new pad for it. Um, the plastic intakes were broken up, so I come up with this homemade dash arrangement. Got rid of the stock plastic. I uh, went with a one switch deal. I went with a Yamaha setup kill start switch, which they're the best in the industry. Because as you can see, everything else I have is Yamaha. So I wanted to go with the same thing. Um, this has good compression. Uh, fires rate up the reason I'm selling it is because it just bothers my hips too much I'm not a young person anymore uh, just getting on and off this thing you gotta spread your legs so wide to get past the seat and it just it bothers my hips too much um, just gonna go ahead and let it go um, as you can see I got a stand up weight blaster I have no problem with them they don't bother my hips but this does a uh, little bit of grass on it we're right next to the yard here it's under a carport but as you can see it's in pretty good shape it's actually in pretty good shape uh, there's no cracks in the skis at all front or rear I've had the whole front end apart re-greased it tightened everything up um, it's a it's a solid machine it's just it's just not for me I had originally I had a plastic handles here they were busted up I put on a different handle it actually worked pretty good for getting you up um, I replaced the fuel cap let me go ahead and fire it up for you guys and we'll go from there this thing hasn't been run in three weeks I'm going to show you something here. It's a little temperature thingy here just to show you. 82 degrees. We'll do it again. That's right on the head. Still at 82. We'll hit the plastic. 84. Plastic's actually warmer than the head. I'm just trying to show you guys this is a cold motor. Uh, I'll give you a little tour of the motor. It's pretty clean, other than this foam all discolored, other than that, but it's pretty clean. Um, I went over some of the wiring, cleaned it up. Um, it's very clean for it's definitely for its age. Like I say it's an 84. So let's go ahead and fire it up. Three-way switch to the left. I'm sorry, to the right is your bilge pump. To your left is your choke. In the middle is just nothing. So let's see what happens here. <laughs> As you see, that's not too bad for a two-stroke. They generally don't fire right away. You let them sit for a while, but as you see, it fires up. It runs, fires it up, runs good. Um, 1500 bucks is what I'm, it's not what I'm asking, it's what I'm selling it for. So don't offer any less. For 1500 bucks, this thing is super clean. Like I say, there's no cracks anywhere in anything. I checked the rear fluid in the uh, lower unit there. That's good. Um, like I say it's ready to go I do not have any paperwork on it I bought it didn't have any paperwork um, that's why you don't see any registration numbers on it I will I will write you a bill of sale if you want I'm fine with that with my name on there no problem but I do not have any paperwork on it and it does not come with a trailer um, I had it sitting on that trailer. Um, not going to put it back on there. It's too heavy. Not doing any test rides. You see it fire up. 
Uh, I know the compression's good in it because I checked that before I bought it. Compression I think was around in the 150 range, 150, 155 range. Um, the one time I had it out, it it got up on plane. It was a little bit bogus, so it could use some fresh gas because the gas that came with it, the guy couldn't tell me how old it was. He just knew it was old. I just added some fresh stuff to it. I really should have sucked the old stuff out. It was just a little bogus, but it did get up on plane. It needs some fresh gas in it, guys. So if you're looking for a clean, wet bike, that pretty much just needs some fresh gas put in it and a rider. Um, that's it. Uh, you can... Uh, I'll throw my email address up in the video somewhere about now. And my name is John. If this is up and running, it's still for sale. As soon as I sell it, I'm taking this video down. Alright guys, see ya.